I think definitely with the new standards, it comes down to really being able to articulate what we want the students to know and be able to do. So starting with those objectives. FIP also plays into the OTES with all of our evaluations and the different parts of that rubric. It fits seamlessly, in my opinion, into what you know the principals are looking for as they come into our classrooms and really what we should just be doing as teachers. You hear FIP and you're like, oh, here comes another acronym down the road. But um, I believe in this one, and I'm not just saying that. I believe that once I took ownership of it and I was able to say, here's a manageable way to handle this, and I was able to see the connection between OTES and FIP and everything else I'm supposed to be doing, SLOs, it's a logical fit. I think it truly comes down to, to effective teaching. You don't just teach a particular, you know, piece of material because you like it or it's a fun one, you know. You really start with those objectives. And now I feel like I'm putting that into practice on a daily basis.